What's the name of this device? Nokia Kinetic device. Um, does it have um, a flexible battery? This one is not auto-powered, uh -huh. uh, but as I said, batteries can be built modular. So the battery probably would not be a huge problem. And how many different uh, motions can you do with it? How many different interaction motions can you do with this? Currently we have um, one, two, three, four, but we can do more than that. It depends how you put the sensors. And, then... and also the combination of twisting and bending can be implemented. Yes, yes, yeah. and, and, but now we haven't implemented this, this but we can, we can measure, for example, this kind of s shape so that you do it like this, but the, we haven't implemented it. It's, mm -hmm. it's, we are measuring basically <laughs> the force, yeah, well. the force and, and the, and can touchscreens be made so they can flex as well? Because I see that this is not a touchscreen device. But it's not a touchscreen device. Can you potentially put a touchscreen and still be flexible? Make it flexible? Uh, well, that is our plan to So, it's, of course, I, I mean, we should have touchscreens on top of that. Mm -hmm. But we don't have it yet. Done yet, all right. Yeah.